Bonjour mes amis, my name is Kyle and I am here today with a Sims 4 Create a Sim or CAS video. Today we are actually making the inhabitants of the Oasis Springs garden house that I did in my last video for a speed build. We end up making a lovely young woman and her name is Layla Rain and a handsome young man and his name is Parker Mitchell. They actually both love to garden, although I feel like Layla likes to recycle a little bit more. Um, and yeah, they both have the loves outdoors trait, just as I predicted in my last video. I foreshadowed myself and it actually came true. I made it come true. And yeah. Layla herself is actually, I think, a more interesting character, especially for gameplay. The story that I currently have given them, which is in their little description setting on the gallery, it's posted under origin ID Arcadia Light and the hashtag Arcadia Light. They are roommates. They have been roommates for, I don't know, a little while now. They have known each other since grade school. They went to high school together. They were, they've been friends for a long time. And basically Layla has always kind of been the shy girl. She's always been the girl that sticks in the back of club meetings and just isn't really noticed around school. She wasn't one of the popular girls. She wasn't like into makeup, you know, all of that kind of stuff. She was just quiet. And today she is just a friendly lady who likes to wave to passerbys as she is tending to her garden. But that is not all of Layla's personality. In fact, she has a secret life and that secret life is she is actually a party machine. She goes out every weekend with the elite club in town and they go bowling or they go to the latest and most lit college party around town in Oasis Springs or San Maestro or Windenburg. And nobody really knows that Layla who gardens and Layla who parties are the same person, uh, which is kind of ironic considering that, you know, they look the same. <laughs> but that aside, the only person who knows is actually Layla's roommate, Parker, and he is not too happy about it. Um, he found out one night when she came home and she had been doing a little bit of naughty drinking <laughs> and she was not herself. And she comes home and he sees that she is completely drunk, which is not good, especially since she is a budding young adult who is currently going to college to become a botanist. Her interest in gardening <laughs> stretches very far, as you can see. Um, and so in the long run, he's like, OK, fine, if you're going to do this, then maybe you should just go ahead and keep these two sides of you separate and so that's what she does and so right now you can see me creating her party outfit you can see how it's kind of opposing to her regular outfit you know her regular outfit has the very loose boot cut jeans with the tank top and the gardening boots and here she's got on a full face of makeup and she styles her hair a little bit differently she doesn't have bangs she puts on glasses she's wearing skinny jeans and pumps and I don't know she's just someone who I feel like has one side of her personality that everybody knows and another side that only one or two people really know and so nobody actually knows the true her except for her roommate like I said his name is Parker and I end up giving her the aspiration of botany and the traits of loves the outdoors ambition and self-assurance I feel like all of those things match her personality it's too bad we can't give a fourth trait to Sims otherwise I also would have made her quite shy but I'm not actually sure if that's a trait in the Sims 4 I think you can only get loner which is too bad they really should add that in there <laughs> if EA is watching this oh, add in the shy trait <laughs> thank you um no but seriously so here we are creating Parker Mitchell, who is Layla's roommate. And I actually don't know whether uh, Parker owns the house or Layla owns the house. I'm not really sure it matters 
In the long run, inevitably, they'll get jobs if you do them in gameplay, and they will pay the bills one in the same. <laughs> they will have one household fund. Um, so I guess that really, that aspect of their life really doesn't matter too much. Uh, right now, I was kind of just editing his features. I spent a little bit more time editing his features than I did editing Layla's features. I felt like the sim or the base sim that the game generated for Layla was a lot less ugly <laughs> than the base sim that they gave me for uh, Parker. And yeah, so I spent a lot of time editing his face. I even, once I started doing the clothes and the hair, I still wasn't even done deciding what his face was gonna look like. I ended up coming back and making his nose or his nostrils actually a little bit different, but not that that really affects um, <laughs> who he is and everything. So back to their story. So he is kind of, uh, he likes to fish. Right. And so you've got Layla and she's a botanist and this dude, Parker Mitchell, likes to fish, which I'm not really sure what he would do with that as a viable career. Is that just a hobby or does he have a job in something else? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, that's, I guess, for you to decide. And like I said, you totally can. You can decide anything about them. You can change their story. And you can completely even redo their outfits, redo their faces, re-upload them. I don't care as long as, like I said in my last video, you give me credit for initially uploading them. And yeah, so right now I'm doing his athletic outfit. I made it somewhat similar to Layla's athletic outfit. I pretty much just used the base game. For Layla, I actually used the spa day. I think I pretty much used a variety of packs in this. I know I used City Living, I know I used Get Together, I'm not sure if I used Get To Work, and I know for sure I used Spa Day, but I'm not sure about anything else. <laughs> and even if I didn't, you can totally change their outfits. It's Gucci, it's all good. <laughs> um, so yeah. Right here, I was kind of doing his party outfit. Um, he's not the total transformation that Layla is. Uh, as you know, she has a this double life and he really doesn't. Uh, for their names, I actually did not come up with them on my own. A lot of the times for Sims, what I do for their name is I just randomize the first name 10 times and randomize the last name 10 times. And whatever the games gives me, I go with it. So I went with Layla and Parker. And so here's Layla in her casual attire. Very, very garden-esque. And even her suit for her formal outfit is got flowers all over it. It is a, have a flurry of flowers on it. And her spa day outfit, or <laughs> her athletic outfit, uh, one and the same, <laughs> um, is made of the items from spa day. And I feel like she just looks like so petite in her little sleep outfit. I so wish there were heights in The Sims 4. I would have made her like the really short girl and then he would have been like the really tall guy. Like that would have been cute, but oh well. They don't have heights in The Sims 4, unfortunately. And I don't have the mod because I don't really like to use that many mods in my game. Uh, so <laughs> I'll just have to wait for EA to add in that feature. Um, here we have Parker being all chill, being all cool uh, on his or in his casual attire. And then we have him in his formal attire, although it's not very formal if you ask me. <laughs> He's just wearing a vest and that's about it. <laughs> um, so yeah. And that's pretty much the end of this video. It's a short video. Um, I'm not really sure what I'm going to be doing yet about scheduling, whether I'm going to have set days where I post video or whether it'll just be a surprise or whether I'll categorize each day by specific videos. I'm not sure yet. Let me know what you think down in the comments below. And I thank you all so much from the bottom of my heart for watching this video. And I hope to talk to you all soon. Bye.